guys, so today I did this uh, very pastel-ish eye look. It actually turned out like mermaid scale, so I'm really excited about that. But yeah, so if you want to see how I got this look, then please keep watching. So let's get started. I'm taking my Suva Beauty Cupcakes and Monsters palette, and I am taking the color Joker Diet on a Zoeva 231 brush. And I'm applying that to the crease of my eye. And slightly on this outer corner. Next, I'm going to take this Sigma E40 brush and I'm going to soften out these edges. White from the palette, which is called Got Milk. Same brush, and I'm going to go over that transition again. This is going to softly diffuse the color. Japanesque smudger brush and I'm gonna take the same color sugar diet and we're gonna run that into the crease Then taking a Zoeva 227 brush going to help blend that out Now I'm gonna be doing this same process over and over again except with darker colors. So I'm gonna pull out my Morphe 35C palette. So I'm gonna go in with this color and then eventually go in with this color. Going back in with my Sigma E40 brush to blend the edges. Next, I'm gonna take this Suva Beauty Hydro Cream Base. It's in the shade, and I'm going to activate that with some Fix Plus. This doesn't really need it, but I want like a really like liquidy so I can get like a super sharp line. And then I'm taking this super tiny flat paintbrush. So you just mix it up until it's like a liquidy consistency. And you're gonna like brush off some of that excess. And then I'm gonna like cut the crease about three quarters of the way. And I'm just gonna apply some to the inner corner right here. All right, so you're gonna let that dry and try not to open. And I'm gonna do my other eye real quick.
bit of fan myself. For the center of my lids, I'm gonna take this Urban Decay shadow in the shade Tonic Elf Concealer Brush and apply that to the center of my eyelid. So it's gonna be like extra reflective because of that base that we got going on. It's gonna be like mermaid shells. Mermaid shells, mermaid scales. Wildly Natural Cosmetics Violet Snow Pigment. I have a discount code and it will be written in my description box below, so go check it out. So just taking that on the normal uh, small shader brush that I usually do for my inner corner and my brow bone and I'm applying this over the inner third. and inner corner. And I'm gonna take some of this and put it on my brow bone. I'm just going to take more of Tonic and run that over Morphe 35U palette. I'm going to take this shimmery teal color and I'm using a Firma Beauty 301 brush, super tiny. And with this, I'm going to apply it right here next to that Tonic just so it has some shimmer to transition into that turquoise. Picking up some more Urban Decay Tonic going over this here. For my wing, I'm gonna take NYX Vivid Bright. This is in the shade Vivid Petal. And we're gonna draw a wing. Okay, so now that I have my wings done, I'm going to apply mascara and then I'll be back to apply my lashes. The lashes I'm gonna be wearing are House of Lashes Pixie Luxe. So while that dries, I'm just gonna do my lower lash line. So first I'm gonna take this Sephora Collection Lilac Shimmer Jumbo Pencil, apply that to waterline and lower lash line. It's all over. Just get like a dome brush and just smudge that out. Then I'm gonna take this Akuhoto brush. This is a J144 brush. Morphe 35U palette and I'm gonna take some of this color here, it's the shimmery purple, and apply that to the outer half, the lower lash line. Give it some depth. And this is the finished eye. I'm gonna be wearing Kat Von D Aisha liquid lipstick. And this is the finished look. I look like I really love purple right now. <laughs> I'm gonna try and get another video up on Friday 
because I want to do like a birthday-ish look. Good. Alright guys, so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye!